and welcome to another edition of Carpool Reactions. I'm JD. Just a bit outside. As you can see, I have a guest with me today. I have the one, the only, Miss Brittany Slaves from Unleash the Archers. Hello. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Uh, I know your time is valuable, so I'm going to make it short and sweet because I know you got stuff to do. <laughs> I'm not going to ask you anything about your music. I'm not going to ask anything everybody else does. I like thought-provoking questions. All I right. Like fun questions. <laughs> like, uh, okay, like uh, if you had a time machine and one round trip, where do you go? Oh, this is a really sad answer. <gasps> uh, I would Don't go disappoint to, me. Uh, I would just go to um, the last time I saw my grandmother in the hospital. Oh. For sure. No, that's a really, really good answer. Because I can relate. Mm -hmm. If Josh is watching this, he'll understand. Oh, my gosh. That's okay. Damn, Easy. We're going to like, <laughs> we'll start off like that. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. You, it was your, your question. I was, I'm going to answer it honestly. No, no. I'm glad you did. That, yeah, that got me right there, too, because I've been there. All right. If you have a talk show host, who are your first three guests? Ooh. Uh, can they be dead or do they have to be alive? Anybody. Okay. Past or present. First three guests. I think the first one would obviously be Bruce Dickinson. And then, oh, I don't know. Um, Why? I mean. Because he does so many interesting things outside of music that I love. Like he is a, um, like one of the world's foremost um, leaders of, uh, what's, what's the word? He knows everything there is to know about tanks, tank warfare. He'd be I, cool to talk to. I think that is just the coolest thing ever. And like he, I love the story of when they were recording. Um, I can't remember which one it was. Some uh, somewhere in time, maybe or uh, I don't remember the album. But they were recording in Hawaii and they were doing like a destination record. And he had so much time time on his hands. He just fencing. Fencing. And I just thought that was the coolest thing ever. And he is like a history oh. nerd, just like me. And he flies yeah. um he commercial he's a commercial pilot. I mean like this guy is just amazing. So I would just pick his brain about everything. That. Yeah, oh yeah, man. He's okay. incredible. So it'd have to be like a an hour long <laughs> show. <laughs> I was gonna say an extension on it. <laughs> yeah, because I'd have a lot of questions for him. That's uh, awesome. And then um, number two, Nikola Tesla, I guess. I Whoa, really going back. Yeah, you know, all kinds of stuff. Okay, he's just a very intelligent. He had a lot of really great ideas, but most importantly, he was, um, you know, like kind of a philanthropist when it comes mm -hmm. to science. He wanted the whole world to know. He didn't want it to be secrets, and he didn't want to keep secrets even from his competitors because. He was just like, this is for the good of all people. And this is going to make our, everyone's life better. Why would we keep it hidden and charge people for it? You know, I just love that side of him. So the I think. The greater good side. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I think that would be really cool. And then. You got one hell of a lineup going on here. <laughs> <laughs> My next guest needs no introduction. No. Um. Mm, Hard to top them two. Yeah, I think it would probably be like maybe I don't know Henry Cavill or um, like kind of a curveball, but okay. Is it because uh, of The Witcher or Superman? Which one? Both, but because also I know he's a gamer, and and he's like I've heard War that. Warhammer, and he just seems like he'd be he'd have a lot of sides to him. You know what I mean? I'd hang out with a guy like that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, like, there's a couple actors out there that I think they just seem like cool people and that they would be cool to hang out with. And um, I think, he, yeah, I think he seems like one of them. So, I, you know, it, it would, would, would be fun is picking his brain about, you know, like everything but film and all the stuff that he's worked on. So that's, yeah. I want to know his workout secrets is what I would want to know. <laughs> 
I think those are like all over YouTube. I think he constantly is posting that. Yeah. No, it's the other stuff that he keeps a secret that I'd be interested in. Yeah, him and Thor does it too. God, that dude eats like eight times a day. I'm like, man, I can't. No. 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 (laughs) All right. So, uh, man, those are three damn good guests. I'm going (laughs) to top that. Who plays you in a movie about your life? Oh, well, um, so talking I, about actors. I think hopefully I got a long way to go. So um, I don't know if we know her yet. You know, I'd probably want like some some no name, like some young up and comer that we've never even seen before. You know, either that or I know she's she's kind of like controversial controversial maybe a little bit but i, I think Kristen stewart's pretty awesome oh okay <laughs> okay i can so see that i don't know if she can sing but i can see that i think she, she lip sync it, it. <laughs> she pulled it off yeah okay good call good call all right <clears throat> if you could get away with any crime what would it be just one you only get one uh, I don't know, steal like a million dollars or something? <laughs> Give it to the Just, poor? No. <laughs> <laughs> you go straight jack a million dollars? I'm just going to use it to pay for the next 10 years of touring. You know, just never have to worry about expenses ever again. Oh, man, let me tell you. Yeah. It's going to get better. It's I hope so. <laughs> Are y'all seriously not going on tour with Dragon Force? No, no. I'm getting my refund now, all of them. Because <laughs> I did, I got the emails about it yeah. being rescheduled, and I was like, all right. And then I already said that earlier, did. and I was like, I was like, damn, man. That's okay. There'll be other dates. There'll be other times. Yeah, no, we are planning on coming back, just not with them. So that's cool. Yeah. I'll definitely, I'll, I will be there front row center. Trust me, I'll be right there. I can't Crazy, I just had the weirdest deja vu. <laughs> okay. Weird. So weird. That's so weird. You tell. Just you, you say, j- saying that. I'll be there front row, that whole thing. Front row yeah. center. That okay. whole <laughs> moment that just happened. That was crazy. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's a glitch in the Matrix. Yeah, I know, right? It's like, I've had them before. It's like, you stop and you go, wait a minute. <laughs> what? The Sam Hell. Yeah. And you never figure it out, but it's like you let it go. You just mm-hmm. let it go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like I've been a there. Feeling. It's like a ba- great disturbance in the force. Is it good yes. or is it bad? No. <laughs> but the force is neither, remember? Oh, that's right. And there can only be two. If you were a wrestler, what would your theme entrance song be? Oh, man. Y'all watch wrestling up in Canada? And I said yes. wrestling. Of course. Cool. Absolutely. Dude. The Undertaker was my man back in the day. Loved I remember him. him back when he was Mean Mark Callis. No, I do Twins not. Island. Oh, if they ever had a wrestling trivia show, I would so clean house on that bad boy. I go back <laughs> to the 80s. And I live in South Carolina, so yeah, oh my God. <laughs> nice. What would your entrance theme song be? Right, here comes Britney Slay's name on the, on the marquee and the music starts. What's the song? May I think maybe while you were shouting at the devil by Zimmer's Hole is a good oh. one. Okay. I can see that. Come out, whip somebody's ass to that. Mm-hmm. That's pretty cool. I like it. Pretty I like much it. any of the the um, Zimmer's Hole, like the songs off of that record would be pretty freaking awesome, probably. <laughs> uh, yeah, I like it. Mine would be Down With The Sickness, just for the intro. I don't even yeah, remember got- what the intro sounds like. Oh, wow. Oh, right, of course. That was a horrible impression. It was a horrible no, that impression. Was great. That oh, was that, bang that, on. That, but yeah, oh my gosh. And, and he does sound like that live. I went and saw him last year. By the way, just got to tell you that he was my favorite vocalist for 20 years. Oh, wow. David Draymond from Disturbed. That title now belongs to you. Oh, so, thank you. Take it and run with it. Screw you, right. Draymond. <laughs> I know. I hope he heard that. Ooh, no, I don't. He's a big dude. <laughs> <laughs> I know you got to get rolling here. I'm going to get one more. Sure. Get one more. 
What movie makes you cry, but you watch it anyway? Hmm. Or if there's um, not a movie that makes you cry, we can exempt oh, that one. Many. I cry all the time. Are you kidding oh, me? I'm wow. a crier. For sure. Oh, wow. Um, you know, what's funny is that I know there is one out there that I, I cry every time and I can't honestly think of it right now. Um, oh, shoot. This Dang is a good it. one because you know you're going to cry, but you're like, I'm going to watch it anyway. Because yeah, I enjoy it. exactly. Yeah. Um, I got one and I'm ashamed to say it, but I'm gonna let you go first. Well, I, I know I've watched, um, Infinity War three times now. And I cry every time. Avengers. Oh, at the end with Spider Man. Oh, with all of them. The the uh, everything. And then the um the the next one too. The whatever the second one was. Infinity uh, War. Endgame. Endgame. Cried of yes. Oh my god, the whole opening sequence of that I bawled my eyes out. Oh my god. I just uh, constant. And then every time they go to um what's his face is family the fact that he didn't have any family left and oh constant um god i know there's one i can't I, why can't i not think of it right now it's like one of my favorite movies and makes me cry every time but i like watching it anyways and i can't <laughs> think of the name crap okay what you'll was think yours? of it like hours from now i will i will yeah mine is warrior oh yeah I Tom Hardy in it, and that dude that he's been in a gazillion movies. I can't think of his damn name. <laughs> yeah, we just got that on Netflix, actually. I was like, ooh, add that one to the list, because I haven't watched that in mm -hmm. a million years. Yeah. That one gets to me because my brother and I, our relationship is kind of like that, and we just started talking again a few months ago, so uh -huh. I can That's relate. Good. You're going to think of that movie as soon as we get done here. I know we got to get rolling, because you got to talk to some people here in a little bit, right? <laughs> By the way... Thank you for doing this on short notice, no guys and gals. She just got done doing an entire live stream on Twitch <laughs> with this dude. Oh, what's his name? Glam. He Glam Shatterskull. Whooped his ass on some Mario Kart, too. I'm sitting there like the whole time. I'm typing away going, man, dude, she's drinking, whipping your ass. <laughs> but but that one guy, Soup, soup God, oh, he he's was so killing sterile. everybody. No, y'all have him tested. Incredible. He's incredible. He gonna have to vacate some wins when he comes back positive. He posted though in the chat, and he's like, "Yeah, I have put a lot of time into Mario Kart." And we were like, "All right, like, okay." It was like seventy-five hours or something yeah. like that. I'm like, "Dude, oh, you need time. to find a girlfriend." <laughs> nah. That was a lot of fun. Though. Thank you for doing that. That just—it's cool that you get to do stuff like this. And just again, I know things are gonna get better. You're gonna get back on tour. Things will get back to normal soon. So, Brittany, hey, so. thank you so much for being here. I appreciate your time. Me. Had a lot of fun. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and sign us off here. So uh, leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment. I'm JD. And always be yourself because everybody else is already taken. <laughs> I like that. Don't be a knave. <laughs>